sweet sticky chicken with beautiful ginger and lime flavors. Ah, oh, this is such a crowd pleaser. Okay, so I don't know about you guys, but in my house, roast chicken is king. Everyone loves it, it's easy to do, and so I'm always looking for ways to kind of trick it up and change it up a little bit. So I'm gonna be using my sticky chili and ginger marinade. Now, if you've seen some of my mum videos, you would know that this is actually my mum's recipe. <laughs> it's all right, I get a check later. But don't worry if you can't get it where you live, I'm gonna show you how we make it from scratch. So we're gonna start off with some chilies. Now I'm not going for a lot of heat here, I just want some beautiful colour and a little bit of flavour, so a mild chilli is what you want. And then of course I want that ginger flavour for this chicken, so I've got my ginger. Okay, so the secret weapon for my marinade is that I've got three different types of garlic. I've got my fresh garlic and then my pickled garlic. So this stuff is gonna add so much flavor. Umami, it's gonna add tang, it's gonna add sweetness and of course that garlic flavor too. You could use pickled onion as well actually if you can't get a hold of pickled garlic. Okay, now I want some sweetness with some brown sugar and I want a couple of dried ingredients here. One is dried garlic powder and dried onion powder. White vinegar. Now I want some soy sauce. A little bit of water to round things off. And then finally we want salt because every good marinade has that great balance of sweetness, tanginess, acid and salt. All of that's gonna bring flavor and make everything nice and tender. Now just blend that up. Mm, that smells so good already. Yeah, I can taste the ginger, the garlic. Oh sweetness so good now because i want to infuse this chicken with a really beautiful ginger flavor i'm going to pop some ginger into the cavity there and then i take my epic marinade and just drizzle that all over the top i just want to tie up those legs and then i just want some limes in there because i find that roasted lime is such a delicious thing to squeeze over the top at the end now that just needs to go into the oven for an hour or until it's cooked through. Now I didn't use all of that marinade on the chicken so I'm going to pour the rest of it into a saucepan. Just let that simmer away for a good five minutes or so until it's thick and dark and it's all sweet and caramely and I'm going to baste my chicken with that halfway through the cooking time. Wow that chicken is smelling so enticing already and I just want that sauce that we'd simmered down and I'm going to baste that chicken with that lovely luscious sweet sticky sauce and now back in the oven until it's finished cooking oh the smell of that chicken has been filling my kitchen and making me so hungry all right we're nearly there i'm just gonna take those pieces of lime and get that out onto my serving plate and then you just want to snip off that little piece of string and now carefully transfer our beautiful little guy onto our serving plate and then those pan juices, don't waste those pan juices. <laughs> they are like liquid gold that gets drizzled all over the top. Ah, family dinner done and dusted. <laughs>